up here in the Midwest, you guys. Finally going to dino the Mustang. Uh, finally get to finish some of these videos I'm super, super behind on because the Mustang has been down since August, Power Cruise 2. Uh, so that's why you just haven't really seen me out and about. But check it the short, or the talking short. Uh, we'll just head to the dyno and see what kind of jam the Mustang makes on the ESS G3R 100 mil pulley E85. I think it actually read E91, so that's kind of funny. <laughs> um, no, we just didn't. We didn't put anything special in there. We just pumped high V uh, E85, and it registers as E91, you guys. But let's go to the dyno and uh, see what kind of jam the Mustang makes. Well, we are we are inside the dyno room here. Just want to show you guys what we're dealing with here. It is chilly in here. ESS G3 R 100 mil pulley here. Um, fill system all nicely done, redone, I should say. All right. But we are, yeah. This is it. This is it. There's, there's nothing really to it, you guys. Let's just see what kind of numbers it makes. So we got everything situated. We got the camera, over, the big camera over here. We try recording over here for today. Uh, we normally shoot behind the car during dyno runs, but today we're gonna try to shoot over here today. Uh, depending on what we make on 100 mil pulley, we may may not switch to 90 mil pulley. Uh, we're just shooting for right around the same horsepower numbers. Uh, but if it makes more, it makes more. Uh, as far as boost level goes, we're really not trying to do anything too crazy. Uh, I know this is uh, for like research purposes and whatnot, but stock block, stock trance, you guys. So really not looking to make any more power, but we do want to see a nice power band or a better gains than the ESS G3X on 100 mil. So this is a very good comparison uh, between the G3X 100 mil pulley and obviously this is ESS, G3, ESS G3R 100 mil pulley. So, We'll definitely see what the difference is here. As far as fuel system goes, we're still on 1,000cc injectors. Uh, we swapped to a triple fuel pump system, which I don't think that really will make too much of a difference, but we have the headroom there if we be. So let's get it. Seventy-seven on the first pull. Here is pull number two, you guys. Um, Eight eighty six six three torque two three degrees less timing and about 15 pounds boost. Our third run here, third revision, we made 893, 668 torque, you guys. We're getting there. One last glory run without the intake, you guys. Uh, we put the intake over here. Uh, we'll just see what it does because uh, right now, 15 pounds boost, we made 893. Uh, previously on the ESS G3, we actually made 914 without the intake. So let's just see what it can do. Without the filter, you guys, we have gained um, a whopping what is it, 50, 56 horsepower on top end. That top end is insane. It, dang. All right. Not bad, not bad, you guys. 
Well, that was pretty fun. <clears throat> um, nine, 949, not quite 950, not quite 1000. <laughs> People, yeah. It's, yeah. <laughs> I ain't got no, nothing else to really say other than, you know, we, we didn't make what I thought I was going to make, but we did make what I kind of expected. If that kind of makes sense, you know, like I know we're all shooting for like 1,200, 1,300, 2,000 horsepower. I know you guys are ridiculous. But uh, realistically, though, seeing the gains on the graph, on the dyno comparison versus all my other setups is it's great that's a big gain actually all right i just want to get home really quick um i can't believe it's already dark out like what the heck happened it's so previously on the ess g3x 100 mil pulley we managed to do 914 wheel at almost 18 pounds of boost you guys on the ess g3r 100 mil pulley we managed to do 949 on right around 15 creeping up to 16 psi less boost less timing than the ESS C3X and we managed to do quite a bit more horsepower and torque throughout the entire power band so hopefully you guys enjoyed the quick dyno video I know we haven't really posted much about power cruise one we haven't really worked on power cruise two videos yet and uh we've just been working on this Mustang kind of uh super super behind I know it's already winter here in the midwest and we haven't done finished power cruise one I haven't started power cruise two videos uh we sent the Mustang to the shop after Park Cruise 2, so we just been down for that long. And we're finally just getting to the dyno video, I promise. The, the dyno video is pretty much current. Um, but it is time for winter, and I'm out of breath. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll see you guys on the next one. Hopefully, we'll get to some of these Power Cruise videos, because I really, really want to showcase uh, some of these races. I know you guys have seen them on TikTok and Instagram and YouTube shorts facebook but some of these videos i really want to make into a longer um youtube clips so peace